Well, African football and African football is so prevalent now on the world stage. Will be an intriguing game. It really does have a very special feel to it. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Ivory Coast. First day of the competition, always a special day and a cause for universal optimism. Well, cup competitions have been getting a, a raw deal because of downgraded importance, but these games still offer a, a hold-your-breath ordeal that can be as good as anything out there. Just listen to the sense of anticipation here. What an atmosphere. This sounds important. This sounds as if it matters. So it's down to business here. Haitara. Plays it out to the flank. And here's Chiori. Goes for it! Finishing doesn't come simpler than that. Bang in front of goal. That's just a great finish, but it's down to very clever movement. You can see this has been obviously worked on on the training ground. He knew exactly where he wanted the ball, and it all came good. take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, registering that crucial first goal has now given them more incentive and, and motivation to take this on. And it's Fofana, and here's... Going for goal! Just off target. Gregor did give it a fair old crack, and he'll be encouraged to step up again. Haitara. Mali have hit the front early, a foothold in the game. Well, they've managed to get their noses in front early because they've been much quicker out of the stalls. They've set a high tempo and intensity and look as though they, they want it much more at the moment. Pepe drives it forward. That was a good run. The defence look beaten there. Kone. That's a foul. Simple decision for the referee. Ivory Coast have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Triori. Well, that's where he wants it. Cuts it out. Ivory Coast get it back again. Bonnie drives it towards the front.
Oh, that is lovely footwork. Massive leap! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Ivory Coast can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Gradle moving impossible to wrestle off the ball. Dumbia tries to get it forward quickly. Oh, they could break here. Hoists it forward. There really wasn't very much in that. Far away from being a telling final ball. Look, the game is full of ifs and buts. If only the, the pass could have completed its journey. And it's played forward. Now, shot a goal! Yes, it's in! Perfect placement. The one place the keeper couldn't reach. Well, I think two keepers would have had a hard time keeping that one out. Never mind one. It was real venom in the strike and, and clear composure from the placement. Good ball. Number 15. <laughs> that has certainly made things interesting. Oh, look, Peter, there's a great ebb and flow to this clash, and it's above all expectations for me. Forward it goes. Well positioned to make that interception. All the way back, and they start again. Looking to hit the front line. Gradle is onto it and can take it up. Kessier. And here's the chance to counter. Triori. There will be one minute at a time. Beautifully done. Defending of the desperate variety. And it's half-time here. So, a very watchable game so far. Action at both ends and the team's level. That's a really interesting... So, once again, we're underway. Has he found his... Oh, real danger here! Pepe. Aurier. That is terrific skill. Cross from Aurier. And the assistant referee rightly gives him offside. <laughs> Takes it upfield. Just brushed off the ball there. Sankara plays it forward. Piate. Kone. Dumbia. Dumbia. It's wrestled off the ball. Sankara. And it's Gradle. Gradle drives. Pepe! Chiore. Not one goal so far. And here's Pepe. He's had that put on and the shot. He's got away with one there. Well, one sloppy lapse like that can do a lot of damage, and it was triggered by the closing down.
Hoists it forward. And he's made sure that that won't get through. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Hits one! There was plenty of power on that. Diaby. Marley going about it patiently, perhaps too patient. And they've been caught out here. Gradle. Shoots! And for a moment, time stood still. Ah, oh, that was great pressure to force the initial error, Peter. It's the perfect example as to why this is a favourite tactic of a lot of teams these days. Coached through there. Traore has it out wide and in space. Crosses it in low. Haitara. Real chance! Just so calm under pressure. Oh, this fella's as slippery as a meal the way he freed himself to score. I mean, for that defence, it was a case of, oh, you've got him, no, you don't. Brilliant. Oh. He's made it two, and no doubt he's hungry for more. Ivory Coast are making a change now. Substitution. Well, this is what we've been waiting for. Kanda looks to get on the end of this. Ivory Coast are pressing a lot, not just the front line, but Burnley is the guilty party there. Terms that this will be Coming his final warning. Is Pepe. Number 20. Substitutions taking place. Boli. And it's played forward. And that has been cleared. Aurier goes looking. Traore tries to clear. And it's surely a foul free kick. The booking always looked it. Substitution in progress. And it's played forward. Kiate does well there. And it's been given away. Hoists it forward. Put offside that time. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And there's going to be another change here. Yeah, he's run himself into the ground, hasn't he? And it's it's good to see that the crowd appreciate his efforts because he has put in a real honest shift. Substitution on the field. Number 24. Coming on to replace him is... Number 12. There's a real appetite from them to finally put this game to bed, but will they? And he's certainly caught him there, it's a free kick. He's up, has a goal! Oh, take 
can win style. And that should do it. Within sight of the finish line. When the manager called on him, he was only too happy to repay that fate. Well, the instruction from the manager would have been go on and make yourself a nuisance and see if you can snatch a goal. Mission accomplished. Two up and very little time left. Surely this is it. Yeah, looks very much like the final nail in the coffin for me, I have to say. Piate positions himself well and cuts it out. Get that clear. A real chance to break. Nicely measured pass. Four, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Right through the middle. He's got away, he's had a goal! And more, and more, and more! And they are cruising away! Speed of thought, efficiency of movement, and certainty of outcome. Yeah, and all engineered, Peter, by some smart running and movement. That's already something to admire, but how about the pass? Just wonderful, loved it. Molly grab a three-goal lead. It's just too easy. No doubt as to who has the momentum here now. The only doubt is how many is coming. It's Pepe! And in again. In it goes. It could be a lifeline. Two more needed. Kanda was quick to move in. Keeper's handling wasn't great. That's just top-notch, showed exactly why he follows it up every time. Keeper struggles to hold on to it, ball breaks kindly, he's always about. So is this the start of a comeback? So that's it, it is all over. Victory in round one. Still plenty to do, of course, but one huge step forwards. Your reflections then, Jim. Very nicely negotiated. Not perfect, but it's all about moving on and mission accomplished.